ஹாய் எவ்ரிவான் வெல்கம் டு இன்ஸ்ட்ருமெண்டேஷன் அகாடமி இன் திஸ் வீடியோ வி வில் லேர்ன் ஹவ் ஏ பார்டன் டியூ ப்ரெஷர் கேஜ் ஒர்க்ஸ் பார்டன் கேஜ் கன்சிஸ்ட் ஆஃப் எ டியூப் பெண்ட் இன் டூ எ காயில் ஆர் அன் ஆர்க் த பார்டன் டியூப் யூசஸ் டிஸ்பிளேஸ்மெண்ட் டிஸ்டன்ஸ் டு மெஷர் ப்ரெஷர் தெர் ஆர் மெயின்லி த்ரீ டைப்ஸ் ஆஃப் பார்டன் டியூப்ஸ் C type, spiral type and helical type bottom tubes. For greater measurement sensitivity and resolution are required, spiral and helical tubes are used. These both give a much greater deflection at the free end for a given applied pressure. Now let's see the working principle of bottom tube pressure gauge. When the pressure is applied, the tube straightens out until the difference in force is balanced by the elastic resistance of the material of the tube. As the pressure in the tube increases, the coil unwinds. A pointer connected to the end of the tube indicates the applied pressure. Now we move on to the working of C-type bottom tube pressure gauge. A C-type bottom tube is fabricated by flattening the side of a hollow tube and then bending the tube into the shape of a C. One end of the tube is sealed and the other end is open and this open end is fixed to a support base. The sealed end of the tube is linked to a pivoted segment gear meshed with a small gear to which a pointer is attached. Under the pointer there is a scale reading. When pressure is applied the tube tends to straighten and the segment moves around its pivot rotating the gear and the pointer and shows the exact reading this reading is directly proportional to the applied pressure one limitation of c type bottom tube is the relatively small amount of tip movement spiral type bottom tube pressure gauge the spiral type tube works under the same principle of c type but as the applied pressure increases the spiral uncoils because of the increased tip movement mechanical amplification is not normally needed this results in an increase in sensitivity and accuracy because there is no lost motion from loose levers or gears helical type bottom tube pressure gauge a helical type bottom tube provides greater tip movement than the spiral type High pressure helical types might have as many as 20 coils while low pressure helical types might have 2 or 3 helical coils. It allows the tip movement to be converted to a circular motion by installing a central shaft inside the helix along its axis. By this we come to the end of this video. If you like the video please support us by subscribing our channel thank you have a nice day